Hi everyone, so I want to give some advice to any of my friends, or anyone for that matter, that is struggling dealing with people who uh, follow a certain religion and have a hard time accepting you. Now, over the years and time basically has kind of taught me how important faith is. And with that being said, I would not, I mean, I don't want to be that person to take away someone's faith. Like, I don't want to be that person. But, with that being said, I don't have a problem with someone who is unable to accept me or parts of me because of their religion. However, I will not tolerate anyone who is going to mock me, insult me, make fun of me or just degrade me or disrespect me because of who I am. Meaning, it's one thing not to accept somebody because your religion just tells you that you're not able to, but it's different to go out of your way to mock them or insult them or disrespect them. That is something I won't tolerate. And some people don't get that. What I learned is, you know, I used to bite my tongue and I just ignored it and I mean, it's not hard for me to ignore it. I mean, people aren't relevant, it's easy. But I learned that there are people in my life that I shouldn't be just ignoring it anymore. I need to embrace it. I need to confront it. I need to um, confront it, tell them how I feel, and move on. Because I made another video about closure, but you know, I need the closure, basically. But that's the thing what I don't understand. I have never found a book, a holy book, of any sort to validate that kind of behavior. I have not. <laughs> And I don't, I don't get it. Like, where is this coming from? Why are these uh, people being so aggressive and mean now? I don't get it. Which is, the problem with all that is it's very unfair for people who have a very strong faith. They are pretty much leading a bad example, a bad impression of their actual religion. So let's say Christians, Islam, for example, since I have a lot of friends with those two religions. Um, so when I meet a Christian or a Muslim man or woman who is very aggressive and very rude and disrespectful to me because of how I look or who I am, I immediately think of the people that they're shaming. I immediately think of the good Christians, the good Muslims, the ones that know how to uh, treat other people. They know their faith and their books do tell them to love and accept one another and um, be kind to one another. And yet th this Christian or this Muslim is leading a bad example of their whole faith, of their whole community when they behave that way. That's very unfair. And I get really annoyed because it's unfair to the good Muslims and the good Christians that there are bad Muslims and Christians that behave. The conclusion is, I don't really have a problem with religion. I have a problem with people who use religion to validate their hate and abuse towards others. That is the problem I have. And it really sucks because, like, I mean, there are a lot of good people. There are a lot of good Muslims, good Christians, good Jews. Just good religions everywhere, but there are a lot of other people that give it such a bad name, and that's really frustrating. So, my advice to everyone who's watching this video, if you ever come across somebody who has a hard time accepting you or embracing you, and uh, not only just not be able to accept you, but, you know, they're being disrespectful towards you too, Remind them this. Tell them, hey, you're a disgrace to your religion. How dare you call yourself a Christian? How dare yourself call yourself a Muslim and you behave and treat me this way? Because they should be ashamed of themselves. This isn't what Christianity is about or Islam is about or, or the other good religions. That's not what it's about. That's my message. That's my message today is remember everyone, don't hate religion. Don't hate the faith. Don't let those people who use their faith as an excuse to behave that way. They need to be set a reminder that what they're doing is not acceptable. And that's our job as, as us, human beings, to educate each other and help each other in this life journey that we all share. But that's just what I think. But yeah, I hope you guys have a good day. I'm going to have a good day. It's the month of Ramadan and my family celebrating... Um, Muslim festi festives and stuff like that and I'm kind of excited to spend time with my family but yeah I just thought I'd share that message and um if you guys want to or want me to talk about anything else I am more than welcome to sounds good bye